guys, so we're going to Pop Boys right now. It is a local shop where I live. Um, they have pops, they have shirts, they have sneakers, collectibles, they have everything you can think of and more. Um, they're probably one of my favorite shops to go to. It's just I haven't really been pop hunting in a very long time just because everything I have been wanting or getting has been pre-orders with sodas and mystery boxes. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to go catch up with them, see what they've been up to, see what they got, and um, maybe get some stuff. But let's go. I do want to point out that it is hot as hell out here. Just so y'all know, it is super hot, but ain't gonna stop us. We're gonna go out, do some pop hunting. Let's go. All right, guys, as you see, we're here at Pop Boys. Let's go. We're finally home. This is literally like a few days after the actual hunt that I did at Pop Boys. I was initially going to trade in some stuff, but I decided not to. I decided just to kind of hold off and actually try a live auction, which I did a few weeks ago. Um, so yeah, this is kind of how old this video was, unfortunately, just because I got kind of busy with SDCC work. And But yeah, I just kind of wanted to shine light on a local shop that I enjoy going to. Um, hopefully I can start going there a lot more just because, you know, I've been so busy with work. I've just been kind of like, oh man, by the time I even think about it, it's like too late. They're either closed or it's Sunday. So yeah, but I love going to this shop. This shop is amazing. You know, they have not only pops, but they have sneakers. So like, that's kind of like a cool combination because I do collect both. I don't have a lot of shoes. It's a lot of sneakers like Dunks or anything or Jordans, but I do enjoy seeing, you know, stuff like that because inspires me to want to buy it down the line so yeah but with that said i did pick up one item from them which would be the black panther target exclusive pop tea bundle i've been eyeing it for a while and i finally decided to get it so yeah they had it there for a pretty good price actually um as you can see it's just a, still sealed it is a large because that's what size i am I'm gonna open it up. I've been wanting to see this pop forever. I just never pulled the trigger. And now with the new Wakanda Forever, you know, I feel like it was a good time to get it. You know, it's open now, but it's gonna stay in my collection. I do like this whole line. I think now the only one I'm missing, only two I'm missing is the Chase Black Panther and the Chase Killmonger. I can never find them in a store. Oh, wow. That's actually pretty cool. So it's like, actually has like a texture on the actual box. That's pretty cool. I don't think I've ever noticed that or ever heard anybody mention that, but that's pretty awesome. Does it glow? No. <laughs> I thought that would've been, that would've been pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. I would've never guessed that, um, 
little details like that would kind of excite me. But that's actually pretty cool. So with that said, we'll go with the t-shirt first, which I'm sure this is a very old pot tea bundle. This is an old t-shirt, but it's new to me. So, and if you haven't seen it, it's new to you too. So this is gonna be the actual t-shirt from the bundle. This is a pretty cool shirt. I do like it. I'm excited to actually have it now. Um, like I said, I always passed up on it because I think at one point it was like 80 bucks. And I don't think I spend that much for it. If I'm being completely honest, it, I think it was like a pretty good, decent price compared to where I've seen where, everywhere else for a large because I think that's more of like a common size. So yeah, that's a pretty cool shirt. And now for the pop. So this one, I had been, like I said, I've been eyeing for a while and I'm so glad to have it. And it's finally seen the light for the first time because I finally opened it. But yeah, this is gonna be Black Panther, the Target exclusive. This is gonna be 273 in the line. This one is pretty awesome. I've seen pictures of a glow, but actually seeing it in person now and seeing the glow on this thing is amazing. Details on it, this is basically the exact same thing as the Chase, but it glows in the dark and it has purples. It's still, in my opinion, a badass pop. Like, I do like this one a lot. I'm so glad I'm close to com completing it. Ah, I don't know why I can't talk on that one. I'm close to completing the set. So, yeah. Now, like I said, all I need is the regular Chase Black Panther and then the Killmonger Chase. Which, man, I think those are... I think that Killmonger Chase is probably the best Chase in a long, long, long time. In my opinion. I mean, I'm sure... Other people might think otherwise, but yeah, I think that's pretty cool. So yeah, this is what I picked up from Pop Boys. I super glad I got it. Um, so guys, thank you so much for the you know support. Thank you for you know letting me record inside the shop. Um, but yeah, go check those guys out. I'll put their Instagram in the description down below. But I also got some packages, so let's check them out. I do have another package here from Pop Boys. This was actually from their whatnot auction. Um, so yeah, I ended up buying something from them just because I want, like I said, I like supporting local. Um, I do like supporting those guys. They, I think they're doing great things there at the store. Um, so yeah, this is gonna be a auction that I won. Actually a pretty good deal too, I think. Uh, all these packing peanuts. All right, so let's see here. All right, there's nothing else. All right, cool. So we're gonna leave that there, take the peanuts. Packing peanuts out. Great packaging, by the way. So if you guys buy from them on the Whatnot Auction or on Whatnot app, you know, they do ship very well. So guys, thank you for that. Um, yeah, so this is gonna be Gollum from Barnes & Noble. It's gonna be the exclusive to them. This one's like a translucent one. This is actually a pretty cool pop. I do like it. Um, yeah, I got it for five bucks. So that's a pretty good deal and on its own. Um, I don't have many of the Lord of the Rings, but I do like some of the characters, so I'll buy some here and there if I find them. Um, but yeah, overall, this is a pretty cool pop. Again, I got it from Pop Boys on their Whatnot Live auction. Go check them out on there as well. I'll put a link to that as well. And last but not least, we have another package from Pop in a Box. So let's get into that one. All right, guys, so we have another package here from Pop in a Box. That doesn't sound good. It never sounds good from pop in a box so yeah i for actually forgot i pre-ordered this thing until it showed up or until i got charged and i was like oh well i guess i got this one now <laughs> so is it is it damaged no oh, what do you know it's not damaged all right so this is going to be jane foster AKA Mighty Thor from the new Thor Love and Thunder. This one's pretty cool. I know there's like a common version. I know there's like several versions of her now. Um, but this one's pretty cool. I did like it just because it glows in the dark. So um, yeah, a little dirty on the window. But overall the details on this one is pretty cool. The glow on this thing is actually pretty good. It's not too bad. I do, I do like this one. Um, yeah, I did like the movie. The movie was actually pretty good. But um, I don't think I'm gonna collect the whole line. I might get the Thor. Um, I think there's also like a new 
Entertainment Earth exclusive, where he actually has, like, uh, in the beginning of the movie, where he has, I don't want to spoil it if you haven't seen it, but overall, that one's a pretty cool one as well, so yeah, this is a pretty cool pop, I'm so glad to have it, um, I won't, like I said, I won't collect all the line, I'll probably get some of them, maybe just the exclusives, just because... I mean, most of the time they make a common and then they make exclusives of the common with just like a different paint variant or go in the dark or yeah, whatever they do. So, but yeah, overall this one's pretty cool. I'm glad to have it in the collection. But uh, yeah, so let me know what you guys think, uh, what you think about the store, that Pop Boys, you know, like I said, I do support them very much. Um, tell me what you think about the Gollum, what you think about Black Panther. If you plan on getting the new wave of Black Panther, let me know in the comment section down below. But again, guys, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. And of course, we'll see you on the next video.